Oh shit. Oh shit, what's up YouTube? I was doing I was on a roller coaster. I don't know if y'all can see that, but y'all see me on a roller coaster in there? Y'all see it in there? I was out. It's fun, it's fun. Uh, let, me, let me turn this Jim Jones off. All right, so of course, I'm about to do a review on this little uh, VR thing. It's so many of these things floating around, it don't make no sense. This is by a company called uh, Pop Tech. Um, it's so many different other brands out there, it don't make no sense. You know, I had the trusty little ZTE in there. You know. uh, but anyway, it's not a bad uh, VR set. It's pretty standard. Let me show y'all what came in the box since I didn't do a unboxing. This is what the goggles was in. Uh, I mainly use my iPhone in this thing, so the supply remote is pretty much useless. It probably worked better on Android, but uh, I don't really have an up-to-date Android device to try it on. Uh, uh, instructions and, you know, stuff like that. Uh, if I read the instructions, I could tell y'all what this is for, but... um. I don't know. A cloth to wipe your lenses. And the NFC chip, which is useless to me because uh, Apple was stingy with the NFC and they only decided to use it for one feature. But that's another story. So that's pretty much what's in the box. Now, hard plastic is the construction of it. Uh, a lot of people from the reviews I saw, they said it's no button like on the Google Cardboard. So they say you can't, when it tells you to like press where the magnet's supposed to be, it's nothing to press. This plate in the front comes off. And if you see those two magnets on the left and the right, which makes this plate stick, Those are actually buttons if you're using an app that requires and tells you to push something. It's not a click or anything, but if you tap it and when you're looking, it works. So you can adjust it, you know, let me see. I don't know if you can see it went out some when I turned the knob. So you can, that's for, uh, you know, close up, far back, depending on what you're doing, if you're playing a game or watching something. Uh, it fits up to an iPhone 6S, as far as I know. The phone goes in here. It, you know, it expands. Like I said, I had the little phone in there just now. 3.5 inch screen. A little small phone, track phone. Nothing popular. But uh, that's pretty much it. I mean, it's not much to it. I like the fact that besides, uh, it's different than cardboard because, you know, you can strap it on and you don't have to hold it. So like when I'm playing my shooting games and I can just look, I don't have to hold it. I can like chill, you know, like take a sip of something while I'm playing my games. Uh, you focus with this little knob right here. And I don't know if you can see it, but when you focus with the knob, it just, you know, gives you a little, depends on what you're looking at. If it's not right, then hit the focus. So, uh, I got this for review. Oh, one more thing. If you scan this, it'll give you some information. But for me, it came up in Chinese. And even translating it didn't really make sense. Uh, like I said, I got an iPhone, so I couldn't really download nothing from that. But maybe Android people can download something from it. And it's, it's not bad for the price. I got about maybe uh, seven apps that works with it. And like I said, the remote, it, it does do stuff on my phone, but it does dumb stuff like control the volume and take a picture and all that kind of stuff. But I want it to work the apps, but it doesn't. No, nah, that's not bad. So like I said, uh, I'll put the link in the description. Y'all can go check it out if you want. I know it ain't like the Samsung VR goggles and all that stuff, but it's a nice little thing to experience virtual reality. And... I say go for it for the price. As usual, I'm out. Thanks for watching. Oh, yeah.
I got a clip that I'm gonna attach to this with somebody using it live in action. So shout out to my man C McNeil for letting me put this up. I holler at y'all. Thanks for watching. <laughs> They come fast on that joint, don't they? <laughs> you, you backing up like they really coming at you. Yeah! <laughs> I told y'all, it's fun. Y'all just, just get one, just get one. Just go ahead and order it. Spend that little couple dollars to experience it. If you like it, get you a better one. But. It really is fun. All right, I'm out. I got shit to do.